Take the hanging thread from the right spool and pass it through the hole near the tension discs. Then pass it between them. The thread should pass under the metal guide. Then wrap it around the bobbin several times and place the bobbin on the winder. Pull the metal lever towards the bobbin and the winder will engage. The bobbin will be winding while you're sewing. If you want only to wind the bobbin, raise the presser foot, remove the thread from the needle and hold it. Press the pedal and wait until the bobbin is full. Don't press it too hard, wind the bobbin at medium speed. If you forget to lift the presser foot, you will probably need to buy a new one and replace the feed dogs on the machine after winding the bobbin. When the bobbin is full, the lever will disengage automatically. Release the pedal and remove the bobbin from the winder. Now let's insert the bobbin. The process is the same as with the domestic sewing machines. Take out the bobbin case, remove the empty bobbin and take the full one. Make sure it will unwind in a clockwise direction while it is in the bobbin case. Then push it until you hear a click. You can open the slide plate so you can see clearly. Now see how it looks when the machine is open. You can rotate the flywheel by hand or use the button to bring up the bobbin thread. But be careful if the machine is turned on. See you in my next video. Bye!